It's no secret that the Anker F3800 is a great choice if you're looking for a portable power station to run your home when the grid goes down. Now there are a lot of ways that you can connect the F3800 to your existing home's electrical panel. In this video, we're going to compare the pros and cons of two very different options to help you decide which is going to be best for you. Those options are the use of a generator interlock kit, which is the easiest and most cost effective way to connect your F3800 to your home's breaker panel versus the new Anchor Solix home power panel, which not only gives you the ability to connect to your Solix F3800 to your home's power system, but also includes some other features as well that might even pay for the difference in cost. Before we begin, it's important to remind you that if you are uncomfortable doing this kind of work, it is best to seek out the help of a professional electrician along the way. While both of these jobs are something that a proficient DIYer can take on, if you're uncomfortable, play it safe. If you're looking for the cheapest and fastest way to quickly start using your F3800 for backup now, the interlock is a great choice. But if you want the additional flexibility, higher performance, and the ability to save money, the F3800 and home power panel are the way to go. It's time to turn our attention to the breaker panel itself and install the actual interlock kit. What this does is it will bolt onto the top of the dead plate, which is this plate right here, and it is a physical device that prevents the main breaker from being in the on position at the same time as the breaker in this position. And this will make it so that anytime the Solix breaker is on, the main breaker has to be off and vice versa. When it's time to power our building off of the Solix, all we have to do is first switch the main breaker to the off position. That allows the interlock to slide up. And with the interlock up, we can then turn on the breaker that connects the Solix to the panel, powering our whole building and giving us power when we need it most. We simply take our extension cord, connect it to the power inlet that we installed earlier, the other end then goes into our 240 volt EV charging output right here. We hit the button that activates our AC output. And then it's as simple as turning our main breaker to the off position, which allows the interlock to slide upwards. With the interlock in the upwards position, we can activate the breaker that connects the Solix to our main panel. And now we're powering this whole building off of our Anchor Solix F3800. Now when the power comes back online and it's time to resume normal grid tied operation, it's just the opposite of installation. We simply take our breaker that connects the Solix to the panel, flip it off, slide the interlock down, and then that lets us slide the main breaker back to the on position, tying us to the grid, making sure the F3800 can't try to feed into it. It's important to remember that if you wanna make sure your batteries are recharged for the next blackout, you'll have to manually plug your F3800 in and let the battery recharge. While this is a great option for quickly and easily getting the power out of your F3800 into your home in the event of a blackout, there is a better way to do it that might even pay for itself, and that's the new Anchor Solix Home Power Panel. The Home Power Panel is a device that functions a lot like a transfer switch, but with some advanced features. That means that it needs to have its own connection to either a sub panel or a panel that supplies the power to the circuits that you wanna keep powered up in the event of a blackout. Additionally, it needs to have power coming into it from a grid tied source. There are a lot of ways to accomplish this. And again, if you feel uncomfortable, it's best to consult an electrician to make sure your install is safe. Not only does this offer you the ability to power loads off of your backup power source, the F3800 in the event of a blackout, it comes with a lot of extra functionality. The first and most useful form of functionality is the ability to automatically transfer over loads in the event of a blackout and supply power to those circuits in your home without any interruption. This is great when compared to a generator interlock kit that requires you to manually switch things over. When a blackout hits the home power panel, you'll hardly notice it. The lights will flicker and all of your loads will be instantaneously powered by the energy stored in your F3800. Now when the power comes back on, not only will your loads automatically be retransferred to the grid, but your F3800 will begin recharging by itself. Through the use of different modes available to you within the Anchor app, you can program your home power panel in F3800 to rely solely on the use of power generated from your grid-tied solar system to power your home all throughout the day and into the evening, minimizing the amount of money you spend paying for electricity from the grid. That means you can reap the benefits of the long lasting lithium iron phosphate battery bank in your Anchor Solix F3800 to save you money on your bills month after month. 
it would be easy over the course of a year to save enough money to offset the cost not only the difference between purchasing the home power panel, but even paying for the installation of it by a professional. When you couple that with the ability to monitor in real time your home's energy usage and money saving using the Anchor app, installing the home power panel becomes a very attractive option for making sure that your home is powered in the event of a blackout. Now that we have the home power panel mounted and the conduit ran, we can go ahead and start wiring it up. We will begin by going outside and disconnecting the wires that feed from the home's main panel, which is outdoors, into this one. We will now run new wires from that main panel into this box and come out and go into the grid input on the home power panel. That's going to supply this with the power it needs from the grid. Then we will run from the backup output of the home power panel into our breaker panel here that was once powered directly from the grid. That's going to supply the power to all of these circuits in the event of a blackout. Another advantage that the home power panel offers you that a generator interlock kit doesn't is the ability to connect two F3800s to meet the demands of your home when the grid goes down. That means that you can have up to 12,000 watts of continuous output to run even high demand appliances when the grid is out. And that's a feature that you can't get using just a standard interlock kit. It also makes sure that both of those F3800s recharge automatically and are available for you when you need them. While both of these solutions give you the ability to take the power of your F3800 and use it to supply your home in the event of a blackout, I think that the advantages offered by the home power panel, coupled with the ability to save you money throughout all times of the year, make it a clear top pick for a home backup power solution. If you like this video and want to stay up to date with the latest news and product info, make sure you hit the subscribe button so that we can keep you living in power.